All right, everybody. Do a video real quick about the KLV BEP20 pair that has just been released. Um, I did a video on ERC20. Now I want to do one on BEP20 to show you guys where you can get it for mainly for our Binance Smart Chain fans out there. Because, you know, there are a lot of them. It's a great, great, um, it's a great chain. They are doing big things on there right now. Obviously, I bleed clever. I'm all clever, pretty much. I own a couple other coins, as you can see. But let's get into this. So, first off, I want to show you the swap. So, I showed you guys the swap with ERC20. Um, how that affected in fees. The, the little amount you would get if you converted. The minimum amount. Um, of TRC 20 KLV to ERC 20 KLV. I think it was about 175, maybe like 200 difference, 175 about you lost in KLV from the conversion because ETH fees are wild. So at the top, we're going to do TRC 20, right? And now at the bottom here, we're going to do BEP 20 to see what the difference would be. Now, if you watch my Ethereum video, I got 325 for converting 551 TRC20 KLV to ERC20. Now, this is Binance, so let's see what we get here. We'll do 551, and boom. You see that? We still get 535 KLV. So, the fees are way less than the ETH blockchain. Um, and that's awesome for the people that don't have a lot of money for fees alone um, and just really want to do a quick swap for BP20 KLV. This would be a great way to do it. So for us KLV users um, and TRC20 users on the Tron blockchain, this is probably your best way to do this. Just simply go into the Clever app, go to the swap feature, put at the top KLV TRC20 and put at the bottom there. KLV BEP20 and do your conversion. You're going to see that it's way easier and the fees are pretty much non-existent there. Um, now, with that being said, for our MetaMask users um, of that wallet, I'm going to show you how to do this within PancakeSwap. So first off, we got to head over to Twitter where I have these saved. I will have these in the description of the video, so do not worry. Um, it will be the legit contract addresses, so you don't have to go anywhere for them. I will make sure they're the exact real ones because they were sent from Dio, the founder and CEO of Clever. So you really have no issues there because on these blockchains um, and swap, uh, these swap apps, they can actually create that coin, a KLV coin that isn't KLV. So you would just simply be buying some random crazy klv coin so i make sure i put these contract addresses into the description of my youtube videos got cut off there for a second i will put these in my description as well the bscscan.com um and the contract address as well so we're gonna go over to the bscscan.com and we are going to find where it says profile summary we want to copy that contract address right there. Now, we're going to head over to MetaMask. And we are going to simply go into the browser. And I'm already on PancakeSwap. So you want to do PancakeSwap.Finance. That's the website. So you're going to start off on this page here, which their interface isn't the greatest. So you're going to have to hit the little... um navigation bar over to the left the sidebar and we're going to have to hit trade hit exchange and now we're in the exchange on the binance smart chain now one thing i do want to address here when you're in this wallet if you are new to it make sure at the top here you switch it over to the binance smart chain at the bottom because i'm pretty sure when you download this app you are stuck on the ethereum main network and you have to switch it over before you go into pancake swap all right, so just that's that's a note, of, uh, just some info right there for the newbies that don't know how to use MetaMask. All right, so let's go back to the browser, 
Now, the same thing we did in um, Uniswap on my ERC20 video, I'm going to do here, but with the Binance Smart Contract. So we hit paste and boom, there is KLV, right? So I've already added it. So the managed tokens thing works on the same, uh, works the same here as it does with Uniswap. Go into tokens, I'm gonna delete it so I could show you guys how to add it. So again, put in the contract address, we hit import. It's going to give you the, anyone can create BEP20 tokens on BSC with any name, including creating fake versions of existing tokens and tokens that claim to represent projects that do not have a token. If you purchase an arbitrary token, you may be unable to sell it back. So make sure you use my contract address that I have in my video, because if you don't and somebody gives you a different one and claims that's the right one and you do not do your research, you are going to be buying a coin that you possibly cannot sell back for any money. And then your money is gone. So be very, very, very cautious when using these. Um, it is all new to everybody, pretty much. I mean, we've only been with these swap services for not that long. So just make sure you know how to use them before you do it. Then we just simply import it. And again, I don't have any BNB on MetaMask. I don't use MetaMask. I do on my Clever Wallet, which I would have shown you guys how to do this. But I don't have any here. But again, it's the same thing as Uniswap. Same thing as Pancake. I mean, um, just swap and you swap on the Tron blockchain. So just simply put how much you want to put in, how much you want to convert. And this one will actually tell me how much, which is awesome, even without a balance. So if I do 0 0.05 of BNB, I will get 488 clever tokens on the Binance Smart Chain. And then once you're done doing that, you will see the balance in your wallet here. You'll see KLV. And you can actually add it yourself here if you want. Just pop in the contract address, add token, and boom, right there. Sorry, I keep getting cut off, guys. Um, it's right there. I just named it KLV. That's why it says KLV, KLV. You don't have to put a name on it, I don't think. Um, but that is where your KLV will be within the wallet. And then you would just simply send that out right to your clever wallet and you guys know how to do that obviously we would just go to our binance our klv bep20 which is right here and we would grab the address and we will put it right in metamask obviously it's not going to send anything and boom but obviously if you guys don't know i'm not going to say obviously if you don't know you need bnb to send out of metamask all right, so you will have to send out of MetaMask, but have a balance of BNB in there to be able to use for fees to send out. It's not much, but you will need some to be able to send out your KLV BEP20. All right, everybody, that was pretty much it. I just wanted to make these videos so you guys had a better understanding of how to use the KLV on the Binance Smart Chain and just have a better understanding of how this all works. Like I said, again, for us KLV TRC20 users, it would be best to just use the swap feature here because it's cheap and you don't have to worry about all that extra. See, I mean, it's only about six KLV coins to convert. So really, this is your best bet if you are a Tron uh, fan. If you are a Binance fan, you use MetaMask, you can buy on MetaMask, Trust Wallet, whichever one has a browser, and you can use PancakeSwap while using the Binance Wallet, Smart Chain Wallet. All right, everybody. Thank you again. You guys are awesome. Thank you for subscribing to my YouTube. I'm at 200 subscribers now. Pretty amazing. Let's just keep this clever knowledge going and just keep feeding it to the world. You guys have a great day and just keep spreading that knowledge.